Hey guys, it's Queen Deja, and in today's video, I will be reacting right to episodes 13 and 14 of Summertime Rendering. So let's go ahead and get started with episode 13 and 3, 2, 1, go. Wait, no. Yes, we know. Yeah, your eye. Mm-hmm. Because that was the reason why Mio died. Oh, okay. Of course, he's still not trustworthy. <laughs> Yeah. Oh, we got a new opening.
Exactly, he's your kid. Five minutes, really? Damn. Yeah, so we gotta go through this again, Jesus. Maybe. No, she can't know that you're technically alive even though you're not. Let's hope this goes according to plan. <laughs> Still, <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> yeah, she like a pretty cute. <laughs> oh, my God. Come on now. Everybody know about pretty cute. <laughs> Damn. 
that's just crazy. But smart though. Hey, but what if that's different, though? I mean, we are in a different loop. See? what I just say? what I just say? Oh, this show stressed me out. Oh, which also means she's been listening to every single fucking conversation. So now the question is, how can we get the mark off of Shin? She'll still find you. Maybe Heine just, you know, created it herself. See? Boom! Boom! Da! Okay. Now where are we? This is now loop six. Oh, 
shit. Oh. Can't open the door. Face th there you go. At least he gets to see his parents like this. Hmm, okay. Well, damn. With the shadow. Now, would this be the day that she met her quote-unquote friend? Yep, all three are coming. I got a bad feeling about this.
So I'm guessing she will only come out for her. Okay, hold up. Wait, 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 wait. But, okay. Does Hizuru remember that she's met Heine? I mean, because if she doesn't, then this... And even if she does at the same time, too. This... Ooh, excuse me. This changes everything. I... Uh, okay. All right. Where are we going, show? I got one more episode before we done. Where are we going with this? Every single week, show. Where are we going? Because <laughs> we're going somewhere. <laughs> like, I'm very confused right now, especially with this ending. I think this is now officially the most that I have been confused with this show as of right now and honestly I'm not mad at that I I love when shows confuse the hell out of me and I'm trying to figure out how it's gonna go and such but yeah where we going show where the fuck are we going because bruh I, I'm I'm, mm -mm, I'm lost right now with this how how does she not remember that she met Heine in the past now okay hold up what if what if here's a what if what if Heine erased her memories for her not to remember her and such? Something else happened that day between Heine and Hizuru for them to go from friends to now enemies. Which is, um, uh, okay, Asa, uh, not Asa, um, Ryunosuke, Ryunosuke dying. That's what it has to be. Something else happened that day. And, of course, she blamed herself. So, maybe. I don't know. Maybe we'll get that context clue in the next episode. But, bruh. Mm-mm. 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 Something about this ain't good. So, then it makes me also wonder, has um, Hizuru, as a teenager, met the forearm shadow as well? Because the forearm sh shadow is created from Heine. So are we going to see the creation of that in this next episode? Once again, this show could go anywhere in the next fucking episode. But yeah, you know, I, I mean, it was good. I, I got some questions on this time travel. I wasn't expecting it to go that once, you know. Whew, excuse me. Oh, my God. 310 in the morning. I'm sorry. Um, Once Ushino killed him, I wasn't expecting them to go to jump all the way backwards into time. Where, you know, the adults are now teenagers and such. I was expecting it to still go back into the regular loop. And then maybe, once he killed himself again, then he would go back in time. But yeah, who knows. But go ahead and pause the video. And I will see you guys in one second for episode 14. Alright, episode 14 and 3, 2, 1, go. Excuse me. Then the is shy.
aka show um yeah show's dad The forearm shadow. Mm -hmm. I'm guessing so. And that's when she got addicted to drinking blood. Look at her eyes. Hell nah, she don't know it well. That food's not going to help, though. Hmm? Oh. be as asking the questions. <laughs>
please tell me this isn't the episode where he dies. It is, it is, it is. It is. Oh, she not sick, she hungry. Damn. Oh my God. Thank God, and of course he followed her. And so he's been with her ever since, damn. Holy shit. Mm-hmm. God damn.
Nah, man, she lost her brother, and now her brother is inside of her and as a ghost. Woo, it is crazy. And this must have been the day she left. Mm hmm. I'm probably right there. She just like vowed to herself, I'm never coming back home. Oh, hi, Nick. She, my ass would have never came back. Been like, I got threatened by my friend. Mm. You think I want to come back to my hometown, bruh? Nah. Mm -mm. He over here eating like he a part of the damn family. Jesus. <laughs> uh, so, of course, he can reach a limit. I was wondering that. Because I was like, what if there's a point where he he dies and he can't get back? Okay. Uh, so, okay. Getting more people into it. Okay, smart.
Aw, oh, please tell me he ain't dead. The fuck was that? No, nah, we got a bad feeling about that. Bad feeling. Mm. And why she gonna get shot right in it? Yeah, but no matter what, when Shin dies, you're all fine. Exactly. Plus, What's-His-Face just died again a couple of minutes ago. So... <laughs>
What the heck just happened? What just happened? He just got killed. They literally... I was not expecting that. Was not expecting that. Okay, that was nif that was different. That was new. I did not think that and it had to be the forearm shadow. Of course, he was like, "All right, yeah, I'm going to take the shot. We're going to kill Shin. We're going to draw all this out of him." To the point where he can't loop anymore. Because still you have that feeling that yes that is going to happen. That no matter how many times Shin kills himself. There's going to be a point where he has to exceed that limit. And I feel like we're getting closer to that. But now that it, it, it's it, it's different because someone has killed him. Not, um, not Hizuru. Not himself, but the forearm shadow. So would that be, and especially because of the fact is he got looped to the part later on in the day where he was making the sandwich. So that has to mean something, right? What show? Once again, what the fuck? Where are we going? Everything was fine. Everything was fine. Up until what's his face died, and the forearm shadow got the damn gun. That's all. This was a very interesting episode, especially on the connection of Heine and Hizuru, especially how that ended in the previous episode. Was not expecting that in the end, that is the reason on why she left. And such. I'm thinking, okay, yeah, your brother mysteriously got killed by something. We don't know what it is exactly. And because of that, you left. And such. But. Whew, excuse me. Because it was Heine who killed your brother. And copied him. And immediately his soul goes into your body. And now you have a dual personality where you both switch and you're using her body as the main source. Like, bro, this show is crazy. This is something that, that would happen in a damn story. Like, in a really good, interesting science. Like, sci-fi light novel s murder mystery. I mean, Jesus. Yeah, 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 yeah. Somebody's going to get inspired by this show. Somebody probably has gotten inspired by this to write something really good. Like, very good. Like, Jesus. But, um, yeah, I want to know now because the fact is the forearm shadow shot Shane. What are the consequences going to be? Because normally when it is either, um, Hizuru or himself, like, we know what's going to happen. But now because of the fact is someone who normally, who is an enemy, killed him. What is, what's going to be the outcome from this? This could not, once again, this can and will go anywhere for the next two episodes but other than that guys that is my reaction view towards episodes 13 and 14 of summertime rendering if you guys enjoyed it please give me a like it really helps me out also subscribe to my channel and make videos every single day join the master squad and of course i will see you guys officially all next saturday for patreons and next monday for everybody else for episodes 15 and 16 but until then i will see you guys all next time bye guys